I'm going to demonstrate how to use your Gmail account to send a mass email with personalized attachments. That means each individual recipient will get their own attachment file, in this case, a unique PDF file. To do this, we'll need your Gmail account, a Google Sheet that will list all your email addresses and their corresponding files, and some place to host your files. In this case, we'll use Google Drive. So first, let's go over to our spreadsheet. Here I have my customer names, email addresses, a customer number, and a PDF file whose name is based on the customer number. The last column contains the file names. Now, in order for this to work, the column containing the attachments must be named attachment something. So it can be just attachment, it could be attachment one, or it could be attachment file. It can be anything as long as it starts with attachment. Now, in this case, the files are being hosted on Google Drive. However, the files can actually be hosted anywhere on the public web. If the files are hosted someplace other than Google Drive, then the value of these cells should be the full URL to the file. For example, if these files were hosted on my web server, then this might look like a path to my website instead. like so. But again, we're going to use Google Drive for this example, so let's undo that and get started. Let's go over to Gmail and connect to the spreadsheet. I'm assuming you have GMAS already set up. Click the Spreadsheet Connector button, choose the spreadsheet, connect to it. A Compose window will now launch with all of my recipients. And now let's type our message. I'll personalize the email with the recipient's first name. And now I just need to hit the GMAS button to send this. And we're done. Now if I go to my sent mail folder, I'll see that each recipient received their unique PDF file. And we're done.